it's the economic cost and the economic problems which really provide the European Union with the competence and the legal support for developing a new, new European Freedom Act. It's Article 114 of the Treaty of the Functioning on, uh, of the European Union, which provides the competence. And that's very important when we think about what EU legislators should do, because they can only act within the uh, scope of competence uh, which they have. But it does, uh, in my view, open up uh, a number of uh, possible avenues to develop what I described as a, a as a a more positive approach. And one area, for example, is enforcing much more transparency, both in terms of things like media ownership. And there's a Council of Europe recommendation from 2018, which says that uh, Council of Europe member states should do a lot more to ensure that citizens know uh, who owns the media that they uh, are consuming, um, but also transparency of, for example, allocation of state resources, including state advertising. So there are a number of uh, much more proactive, much more positive measures that could be um, implemented um, as well, for example, in terms of how uh, public service media are regulated uh, and um, uh, monitored. 